Hi, John Brigham, Vice President here at iClight, and this right here is one of my favorite cameras to shoot right now. It is the Canon EOS R5. I like it so much that we decided to shoot a whole series of videos from introducing the camera all the way through what we like to shoot with it, lenses, equipment you need, how to shoot it, etc. So stay tuned for this series that will walk you through that. So to start with, why do I like this camera so much? Well, as I said, it's a full frame mirrorless. It has in-body image stabilization, so extremely great for handheld work. Butter smooth video. The glass choices are excellent. You can take your EF series lenses. You can use an adapter to move them over. The RF lenses that they're coming out with are, are fantastic. Excited to see more and more of those come out. It shoots 8K uh, video in-body, so that's really cool. Whether you're shooting 8K or whether or not you want to shoot 8K and punch into 4K. The autofocus is extremely fast and accurate. I mean, it has an electronic viewfinder or EVF, so I find that it's, it's something you have to get used to, but once you do, it's very useful. You can preview your image, so like a heads-up display. And then lastly, it has a great control interface, both physically, the menu system, all the way from working in the camera to post-processing is very intuitive. This camera is for everybody. Um, I would recommend this to somebody who's just getting started because they have an image in their head and they're trying to achieve that. Uh, oftentimes they'll think, well, it's too complicated, I don't want to go to that level. But with a few tips and tricks, they can really achieve that vision, all the way to the professional who, who knows what they're doing, and they need a caliber that can do that. That's this camera. So I, I, I recommend that for everybody. And just not just scuba diving, you can do pool work and surf. That's why we like the camera. Um, so stay tuned, we're going to do more videos on exactly what lenses we shoot and what equipment you're going to need, how to put it together, what our process is for shooting, not only from camera settings, but also post-processing and, and even how to pack it and, and travel with the system.